only 10 months in power and the DPJ is already facing a major setback. Naoto Khan, prime minister for barely a month, has already had to reassure his cabinet that he will stay on after dismal results in the upper house election. I would like to apologize to our supporters as we ended up missing the initial target goal by far. DPJ still has majority in the more powerful lower house, but these elections reflect deep disenchantment in Khan and his party. I would like to consider the election result very seriously and start afresh to continue leading a responsible government. They will have to start forming coalitions with smaller parties to increase their weight in the upper house. It now means that policy making will be drawn out and painful as the chamber can reject bills approved by the lower house. Policy like doubling Japan's sales tax to combat its record national debt. That proposal has already weighed down the prime minister's popularity. He's backtracked in the run-up to these elections, saying they will be an issue for the next major poll. But it's an example of the uphill battle the DPJ now faces as it tries to implement legislation to revive Japan's economy. It's the biggest issue for Japan's population who are looking for direction on how the country can recover from prolonged economic stagnation. Many would also like to have more security in the face of unemployment and a flagging business sector. I want the government to provide more social welfare, so even if you lose your job and you can't find another job and you don't have money, you'll not end up on the streets. The band Beautiful has been trying to make a living on the streets of Tokyo for the past year. The group of 25 to 30-year-olds sing of fond memories and relationships, but the lyrics are certainly not about Japan's political system. None of them have cast a ballot in this upper house election. I think most young people have very little interest in politics. I know it's complicated, but if we believe in the politicians and they can capture our attention, then more of us will want to vote. The ruling Democrat Party came into power for the first time in 55 years on a wave of optimism and hope. But already with the change in Prime Minister and little progress to show, dissolution set in and it seems they're now having to face the music. Vivi Gopalan, Al Jazeera, Tokyo, Japan.